Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. I wanted to hop on here real fast to let you know about some new bags that are going up in the shop Saturday. Today is Thursday, so Saturday is the 20th of November, and they're going to be going into the shop at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. So if you're if you live in Eastern Standard Time, that's 6 p.m. If you live in the middle of uh, the U.S., where it's uh, Mountain Time, it would be 4 p.m. And if you live on the Pacific Coast, California, Washington State, places like that, <laughs> um, it'll be 3 p.m. I don't know about the rest of the world, <laughs> but those are the ones I know. So I'm just, I always try to clarify that because I always get a lot of messages on my Etsy the day of an update uh, asking where the bags are. And it's because it's not my, it's not 5 p.m. my time yet. <laughs> it needs to be 5 p.m. my time, which is Middle Tennessee Central Standard Time. Anyways. These are going to be, um, or they are, <laughs> they're already made. These are little tote bags. The only thing that's not on them right now is snaps. I haven't done that yet because I just got done sewing them like 10 minutes ago. But, uh, so I do still need to add the snaps, which I'll do that later today. But they are boxed bottom totes. And they're pretty good size. I, I put slightly larger handles on them than I did the last little totes that I did because I had people ask for slightly bigger handles. <laughs> but I got some um, regular prints and some Christmas slash winter prints. All right. And as for size, I forgot. So let me get my ruler. <sighs> for size, they are about 15 inches um, wide <laughs> and 10 inches tall. And it's got a about a 5 inch. I believe, yeah, like a five inch boxed bottom. All right, so I'll show you the regular prints first. There are two of each of these, except one print has three, <laughs> and I'll tell you that one. So there are two of these uh, alpaca ones. They do have boxed bottoms. So they're 15 inches this way, 10 inches this way, and then they have five inch box bottom. They will have a snap right here. I just haven't done that yet. <laughs> I will do that uh, probably later today while I'm relaxing. But they got these decent size handles, so you can hold it like that or just like that. <laughs> and these are meant to be project bags, but I've had multiple people whose bottom told me that they used them as uh, like purses. So that's cool too. But there's, there's, so there's two of those. And then there are two of this print. Like a diamond print. Kind of like a gold metallic color right there. Cute. Again, I gotta add snaps. And then there's two of this one. This is also a diamond print, but it's pink. And there's this print. I like this one a lot. And then, whoop, I want to cause an avalanche. <laughs> this this is a really cute print too. Floof them. They've been piled up since I got done selling them. Cherries. I love this print. It's so cute. Cute little cherry print. This is the one that has three. This is like a galaxy print. I don't know. It's like, it reminds me of like a Milky Way or something. There are three of these. Two of everything else, but three of these. They are quilted, so they're smishy. They will have snaps on them. <laughs> they got my labels on the sides. And they are lined. I line all my bags, because I don't like unlined bags. I don't like the raw edges. It just throws me off. <laughs> all right, now all these next ones are Christmas slash winter prints. So this one is just like a winter print, it's snowman. It's glittery, but it's the kind of glitter that stays on there. These ones are really pretty. I just think this is such a pretty bag. So oh, there's a string there. <laughs> Cute snowman print, it's glittery. I just think that's such a pretty bag. You could even gift um, someone something in this and then they could have the bag too. And there's this one, it's Christmassy, wintry. Really pretty, got like shimmery on it. And then there's this one. This one is a Christmas print that is religious. It's got religious um, carols lyrics on it. I don't know if you can see them well. It's raining here today, so I got a lamp on, so the lighting's not the greatest. But it's got, um, it's got like Hark the Herald, Angel Sings lyrics on it, and um, like Oh Come All You Faithful, just different religious Christmas songs lyrics <laughs> and then there's this one that is just a winter print and it is a really pretty deer print in like a winter forest there's another thread see i still gotta go through and trim off threads and put the button the snaps on it that's a really pretty print i've had that before and then there's this print pretty it's 
got like a what's that called buffalo plaid <laughs> and like a Christmassy image on there and then there's this cute tree bag it's like a uh, plaid flannel Christmas trees super cute and then the last print is a really pretty Christmas print <laughs> that is like holly berries and ribbons very pretty I like it a lot these are some really pretty bags I really like these ones I think they're a good size the handles are a good size too you could hang it on something if you wanted to just cute little little totes and like I said I will put a, a snap right here in the middle so that it'll stay snapped shut I just haven't done that yet <laughs> I gotta pull out my kit for that and uh, yeah so there's two of each of those except the one there are three of I think there is 25 all together I can't remember <laughs> but anyways they'll be going live in the shop on Saturday November 20th at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time so yeah mark your calendars or whatever <laughs> set alarms whatever I've had people tell me that they do that they set alarms I set an alarm to update my shop and sometimes I forget to do that and that's why sometimes it's a few minutes late <laughs> but I do try to be punctual uh, when I can but yeah so that's the new bags there's gonna be one more bag update this year after this one and it's gonna be drawstring bags or possibly drawstring bag sets uh, depending on if I want to make the little zipper bags I'm burning it up I gotta put my hair up and then that'll be it for a while <laughs> I don't know for sure if I'll have any coming out in January or February because that's when I'm going to be at the end of my pregnancy and have a newborn. Um, I do plan on sewing after she's born though. Because uh, I enjoy it. <laughs> and uh, I want her to be used to that sound. I did a lot of stuff when Jessie was a newborn. Like most people always tell you. Oh you're going to be so exhausted and not want to do anything. But uh, when I, when Jessie was a newborn. That's when I first got into crocheting amigurumis. And I made all kinds of amigurumis and blankets while he was a baby. Just laying around. And in his little swing and stuff. Um, cause that's all I do, you know, they're for their first like four months, <laughs> they just lay around and do nothing. So, um, I want her to be used to the sewing sound. I'm pretty sure she probably already is cause I know babies can hear inside the belly and I sew all the time. So I'm sure she's used to that humming noise, <laughs> but, um, I don't want it to slow me down. I like making bags and I like that people buy them and use them. I think it's cool. So yeah, my videos might slow down a little bit. <laughs> Depends on how horrible I look after she's born. <laughs> But uh, I do want to vlog a lot because I love looking back at my vlogs of Jesse when he was little. He was about a year old when I started making videos. He was just over a year old. Because I started making videos in June of 2017 and he was born in May uh, 2016. So, so it's fun to go back and watch my old videos of him growing up. And now he's like five and a half. So I, I want to definitely do that with her too because I want those videos for myself. <laughs> but um, yeah, so... These, these bags and then the next bag set, that's it should come out the first week of December is when I'm having it planned. The next um, shop update, probably the 3rd of December. You're on, my, you're on the phone so I can't look at my calendar. I think it's the 3rd of December that I was looking at. I don't have any calendar laying here. <laughs> but I think it's a Saturday. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> but it should be that very first week of December. That'll be the last bags from No Catch Name for possibly a few months <laughs> so um but then I will get back at it because I do love making the bags and uh yeah I'm gonna take it easy after those bags are done and just enjoy December with my family and try to enjoy the holidays <laughs> but things are getting so much harder for me now already that uh I don't know how much fun the holidays are gonna be super pregnant I told Devin I always told Devin I wanted to be really pregnant around the holidays because I thought it'd be fun and I told him this morning I was like I regret saying that because <laughs> Um, it's hard for me to enjoy all the things that we usually do when I can barely walk some days and I get so tired so quickly and I still have nausea every now and then. I had it this morning um, and I have like no appetite whatsoever which stinks because I want to like eat all the things. <laughs> Thanksgiving's in a week so I want to um, pay out you know but I'm not gonna be able to but that's okay. I guess that's good. <laughs> I haven't gained much weight at all this pregnancy. Uh, I've only gained about 10 pounds and she's about three pounds uh, the placenta's a few pounds. Jesse's placenta was like six pounds. His was huge. Uh, plus all the fluids. So most of that's her and her stuff. Um, I did actually lose some weight in the beginning of my pregnancy because it was, I was so sick all the time. But I'm hoping that, I know the end is where you gain the most weight. I'm hoping that I don't like balloon up. Because <laughs> with Jesse, Lord have mercy, I gained almost 80 pounds with him. But I was also really young and really stupid. 
I didn't care at all. You know, I just ate what I wanted to eat and I just sat around and was pregnant. Um, Jesse made me fat. <laughs> Actually, my pregnancy with Jesse made me fat, but um, I'm not worried about it. I'm, I'm planning on getting back healthy again after the baby's born and I get cleared to exercise again. I miss walking and stuff a lot, but um, yeah, I'll do that next year. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to sit here and chill for a few minutes. I got to put them snaps on, but I think I'll do that tonight when I'm watching TV. I've got to edit this video and a national holiday video that I just recorded. And then I'm going to go sit in there and just chill <laughs> until time to get Devin up and time to go get Jesse from school. Because I'm tired and uh, I wanted to finish up the sewing today. So I went ham and did that. It only took about an hour and a half to finish what I needed to do. And uh, got this big old pile of bags done. <laughs> it's a big old pile of bags over here. But I do enjoy making them. Except the zipper project bags. I don't enjoy them very much. They're a lot. It's, it's really easy pattern, but it's just because of the um, the batting and the size of my sewing machine. I don't have like a big industrial one. Um, I have to like roll the fabric up to get the zipper on and it's just annoying. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to go grab me a water and go relax and watch probably some crime show because I've finished watching S Word Creek that I don't want to say because I don't want to get like flagged. Um, and now I need to find a new show to watch. <laughs> but I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video soon later today tomorrow sometime <laughs> and yeah don't forget about the bags going up in the shop and uh yeah i guess that's it <laughs> bye guys